Okay. Yeah, we're good to go. Okay. So it's got a dead man switch on or off. When you want to use the power, you just hit the switch. So it's just electric, kind of electric motor assist. It's electric motor assist. And what kind of battery is it? I mean, do you get much life out of it, much current? 12 uh, volts? Right now I've got a, it's a 24, it's a 24 volt lead acid battery made up of two 12 volt 8 amp hour batteries are standard. It's got a little controller, controls the motor and the charge. Yeah. On off switch. And when I first bought it, about eight months ago, it was rated at about 10, 10 miles uh, range. The range is much lower now. Um, I've used it fairly heavily after about eight months. So. And just because the batteries aren't staying up to capacity or? Well, they're not, but they, they, you know, I measure them after a full load for a while and they seem to be fairly high, but the, the range is obviously dropping off, quickly dropping off. You can also run these with the LiPo batteries and other batteries. There's other batteries. High tech batteries that we were talking about yeah, earlier. Uh, just 24 volts and, um, but this is the basic model that I got. It cost about 400 bucks with the battery. So it is a motor assist, but is there enough power, say, for you not to pedal at all on a flat surface or even going uphill? Yeah, when the batteries, when the batteries were kind of new and fresh, uh, you could just scoot for a long time just using the battery power if you wanted. Wow. Um, and you could charge them with solar if you chose, or you could you could charge them with solar. Uh, I charge mine with the house current, but because uh, it's a 24 volt system, but you could charge them with solar. Funny, we picked this time to talk about this while it's snowing. Yeah, I know. Well, it was warm this morning. It was about 50 <laughs> degrees when I went out for coffee and to work. But you are going to take it home this way. Yeah. Okay, great. I don't live too far from here, so. All right, excellent. Thanks, Dick.